Yeah, one character trait that I'd like our football team to be known for in 2019 is uh, just uh, effort. You know, I'd like to see our team play with great effort um, every down, every play. What it'll look like to our fans in the stadium is, you know, you'll be seeing uh, guys blocking downfield. You, you'll see guys, receivers blocking for running backs. You'll see a lot of guys getting to the football, just playing with tremendous effort. If our team was an automobile, uh, what would I want it to be? I would want it to be a Ferrari. And here's why is we want our team to play fast. You know, we want, to, want them to play the game fast. We want them to play f uh, fast on offense, uh, up-tempo offense. Um, and then defensively, we want to fly around, play the game fast. What I see is the biggest challenge for our football team is replace a lot of great players. I lose an All-American defensive end, a multi-all-conference defensive lineman, a, a multi-all-conference running back, a quarterback who was first-team all-conference last year. So we lose a lot of great players, and so we got to have a lot of guys step up um, this year and replace those guys. We're going to be an offense that plays fast. We're going to be a physical offense, establish the run. We return seven offensive linemen um, that have started in the past. So we've got a very experienced group out there and got some receivers back. So we're going to have an exciting brand of offense to watch. What the Midwest Conference should expect from our defense this year is you know, a defense that flies around, plays the game fast, that has a good time while they're out there doing it. One player that I would expect to have an increased impact uh, this year that didn't last year would be our quarterback position. Now I can't tell you what player specifically that's going to be at this point. It's an open competition but we graduated our quarterback and it's going to be somebody new this year. Whether it's one of our returning guys or an incoming guy, competition will be settled you know in practice and and over the course of the season. You know our biggest goal for our team this season is just you know each and every week and each and every day to go out and get better. A big philosophy I have is just get 1% better. If we can get 1% better every day, every time we step on the field, we'll be where we want to be at the end of the year. Yeah, what I think the benefit of having multi-sport athletes on our football team, it's been tremendous for us. You know, you look at, you know, one of our player returning on our football team is Joe Crawl, a tremendous offensive lineman, getting some NFL looks right now. Our football and track programs have been a great combination for guys. We've had a lot of success with those guys over the years, and uh, we want to continue that trend. What I think has been the greatest contributor to our success on defense over the past four years has been continuity in our coaching staff. Very blessed to have a great defensive line coach in Mitch Russell and a great linebacker coach in Derek Johnston. Those guys do an outstanding job with, with our guys each and every year, um, getting them to play at a, a very high level. We've had you know some tremendous players over the past four years. Uh, you look at Matt Barnes, he was a finalist for the Gallardi program in 2016, Thomas Lisniewski, an All-American at defensive end. We're only as good uh, as coaches as our players, but um, you know, we've been fortunate to have some great players over the past four years.